All right, everybody. Welcome back to the Bob Squad. I'm your host, Chrissy Wan, and I'm telling you right now, I could not be on any more of a euphoric high in my life. And I'm telling you, it feels phenomenal. Now, what exactly am I talking about? You ask? Oh, I will tell you. So, uh, the thing with Resident Evil 7, if, um... You know, if you, if you, uh, you know, got the, the deluxe edition that comes with uh, downloadable, you know, banned footage content, shit like that. And uh, they, one of the things that they included in this shit was the most sadistic form of blackjack I've ever fucking seen in my life. And basically it came with three different settings. Obviously, one, you have to um, beat the person you're playing with. The only problem is... You're uh, stuck, your character is stuck to a contraption, as is your opponent, and your your hand is in, the, in this, like, this vice-like thing, and if you lose a round, wait, Jill. <laughs> let's start on the first floor, huh? That's what I was going to say. Aren't you supposed to be going over the first floor, Barry? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, bitch, we're on the same page. Take a look at this. Oh, Barry. God damn, I love you. Oh, man. So, anywho. It's forest. Oh, my God. God. What happened to him? <laughs> it's a, le a legitimate question. I want to know. God damn it. I want to find out what caused Forrest's death. Good luck. It looks like he was killed by a crow or something. One or more than one. Can you look around the first floor, Jill? Okay, which is what you agreed to do too, okay. you fucking prick. Anyway. Hey, Jill. This must have been Forrest's. You don't have a weapon. Take this with you. I clearly don't have a weapon, especially in my right hand. <laughs> Barry, you dumb fuck, I swear. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I clearly do not have a weapon in my hand. Holy shit. Anyway, um, if you lose a hand, you one of your fingers gets cut off, right? So, if your opponent loses all of his fingers, well then, okay, it's over. You think you've won? You haven't quite yet, because it's going to go to round two. Now, round two is, uh, there's this electrocuting uh, contraption thing of a shit above your hand, right? And it's got 10 levels. If it gets to 10, I guess that's like execution level and you fucking die. Which is a pain in the dick because at first it was just 5 rounds to get through that shit. But this one, it's fucking 10. And then uh, the, the, the third and final round, once you won that one, the guy dies. But then all of a sudden the uh, person in charge turns into like a really sick bastard. Spoilers, by the way. Um, that contraption goes back up. Now he's left with one more. And it's a saw, and, uh, you know, if you lose five times, it comes and enters and just ruins your face. If you win, it does that to him, and you win. So, whoop, whoop, wow! <laughs> yes! Anywho, oh, man, um... Aww... Oh. See if we can keep that shit going. That's fine that we didn't. I don't care. The fact that it happened twice in a row like that is just orgasmic in my eyes. But there is, uh, once you beat that, you get to play what's called survival mode. Is you face five op Cap! Cap! Ah, stop you bitching. You dead yet? Yeah, you're dead. Uh, fuck, where's it going with that? Oh, if you beat survival mode, uh, then you get survival mode pu plus, but there's also a little bit of a catch here. Yes. Um, if you win without being tortured once, without losing a single hand against five opponents, you get something special. Oh, I did that by complete accident. I, and I still didn't even know the rules properly for that game. It was really fucking weird. I got lucky up until that point. And then survival plus mode is 10 opponents, and you have to get, you know, uh, defeat all 10 opponents without being tortured once. 
And that sounds like it's absolutely fucking impossible, and it was for the longest time, because the guys at the end have the biggest pile of shit when it comes to trump cards I've ever fucking heard of, and it is damn near impossible to make that shit happen, but guess what the fuck I got wanting done? I actually fucking did it, and I'm so proud of myself for it. Yes, I am. I know everyone else is out there proud of me, whether you're saying it or not. I greatly appreciate that. Thank you so much. I love the support. Boom. Moving on. I know I left some shit back there, but I had to because I don't have any more space. Okay, well, clearly I do. Uh, we'll go back for it. Pretty sure it was just shotgun shells anyway. Could be grenade launcher rounds, though. We'll find out later. I have shit to do first. Oh, God, I can't believe I fucking did it. Like, my heart was in my throat the whole fucking time. Wow. Jill ain't fucking around. I like that. Wish Chris would have been the same way, but nope. Stupid. Yep, bitch, what you got? Nothing. Ah, yes. Crazy Juan's in his happy place. He is. He is in his happy place right now. Because, I, you know, like I said, it was a fucking fluke that I was actually able to pull it off. But I did. That's all that matters. Is it happened. Yeah. Hey, how you doing? Now, on top of that, I just found out uh, Friday the 13th is coming out at the end of next month, which is ironic because that's when the club's probation is over. So, regardless of where that, regardless of which direction that goes, I honestly, God, could care less because I'm still getting bar stories for, uh, for Frosty's Bar Tales. That is getting views up the ass, and uh, it, it's, yes, it's very good, very good. I, I quite enjoy it. Now, I don't even want to take the risk of something happening, so I won't. Because, <laughs> like I said, I'm in a fucking amazing mood right now. The last thing I want to happen is to me to fucking die. Keeping it going. Excuse me. Alright. Moving the fuck on, yeah! Hey, how you doing? Cap. Woo! Cap. Damn. Bitch, I know you ain't dead. Get up. Now get down. Now you're dead. Sweet deal. Oh my god, I am so happy. I did not expect in a million years for me to actually be able to pull that shit off. I did not think I was going to be able to, but boy, was I wrong. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. There we go. I got my broken shotgun. Meow. Oh, man. I am so happy I did it. <laughs> Did not think it was going to happen. Nope. But it did. That's all that counts. That's all that fucking counts. So while we're here, we might as well go upstairs and get all the shit we need in this fucking part. It's not much, but, you know, whatever. There's a chance I may be able to have this beaten by the time I go to work. Maybe not. We'll find out. Ah, oh, you bitches, they're not letting me do it. Oh, shit. Come on. Ah. Oh. Well, you're not dead. Ah! Oh, get it? Whoops. Just wanted to make sure. <laughs> 
And you're dead. Good. Yeah, I don't. Got a little too cocky on that one. Almost came back to bite me right in the ass. But guess what? It didn't, so I could care less. Oh, man. I'm so happy. I am so damn happy. It's an, and on top of that, my veteran's vest uh, got finished today. So, which I'm actually wearing right now. And they did. Barry? Since when do you bitches know how to open doors? Get up. Yeah, see, it's what I thought, bitch. Nice, I got my veteran's vest done. I accomplished what I thought was going to be impossible. I did it. I'm so happy. Oh, man, I, I just could not be in a better mood tonight. Tonight can go straight to shit for all I care. I, well, I don't want it to, but if it does happen, you know, fine. Let it happen. I don't care. I'm that fucking happy right now. Ugh, excuse me. Yep, pick it up, bitch. Doing it, yes. Excuse me again, everyone. I apologize for my outburst of burps. Oops. Uh, charging. Oh, man, come on, damn it. I'm looking for my charging cord, you fucking opportunistic piece of shit. That's what you get. <laughs> oh god, where's my where's the charging cable at? Is that you, Jill? Nope. What's going on? How come you look so scared? Um Look at this. Have you been paying attention to what exactly is going on? We already read that last time. We're not doing it again. What do you think of it? I've been thinking something is wrong with this house. No shit, Sherlockstress. Right. Hey, what is this? There's a page missing. Yeah, I thought about that. Too. There we go. Perhaps that was the most important part. Perhaps. Well, I'm going to go be suspicious elsewhere. Don't mind me. All right, so I'm going to search you already. Hit the... Yes, do it. No, not quite. There we go. And happy times for everyone as well. Anything in here? Nope. I don't need it. Not yet anyway. <coughs> I mean, there will come a time where I will need it. But that's neither here nor there. All right, so... We're going to stop it here. This is a good time for stopping. So, everybody, thank you for joining me. Greatly appreciate it. Come back next time see what the hell is going to happen. So, will I be able to escape the mansion in the next episode? Who knows? We'll find out next time. So, everybody, come back. But until then, you all stay classy.